We got another BCS game set and another team that really had designs on going to the Rose Bowl. In fact, their fans had scarfed up the opportunity to buy tickets to the Rose Bowl. LSU were probably a little bit disappointed that Florida wound up in the national championship game, but pretty good consolation prize for the Bayou Bengals. LSU just going down the road to take on Notre Dame in the Sugar Bowl. Quinn Samarja dealing with that LSU defense loop. Oh, it's a great defense, but that's an excellent offense that the University of Notre Dame has. Uh, I know that they're coming off a disappointing performance against uh, University of Southern Cal, but they will play very, very well in this bowl game. I, I, it, it's just great to be able to get down to New Orleans after Katrina and everything else. What a good way to make a contribution to that society. And I mean to the people down there in general. And Notre Dame, the Notre Dame fans will do that. And I'll tell you, they will place, they'll come down there in droves. And it won't be all LSU in that stadium, but it'll be a lot of them. Oh, you bet there will be. Oh, you see those teams rolling into the Sugar Bowl against those SEC teams? Mm -hmm. I don't Different care where I don't coach. care where you go. There's always going to be a lot of Notre Dame teams. And, no, and New Orleans, hey, especially. anywhere, anywhere, New, New Orleans. Orleans. I mean, there's a lot of Catholics down there. But even we played Southern Cal 19 <laughs> many years ago. We kicked a field goal to win the game. The fans were cheering. I couldn't tell whether it was for us or us or them. That's how many fans there are. And there'll be a lot of Notre Dame fans there for good reason. You thought that USC had speed on defense. <laughs> <laughs> They're the 66 rank pass defense. They're going to go down to the Sugar Bowl and play LSU and Bo Pelini's defense. They are the third rank pass defense in the country. Leron Landry, the safety, is one of the most fierce hitters in the SEC conference. It's going to be a challenge for Notre Dame's wide receiver, Samarja and company, to have a big game, as you say, down in the Sugar Bowl. You know what? Two games <laughs> Notre Dame has played. Not that the other teams they played didn't have good athletes, but with truly elite athletes. Mm -hmm. Michigan, USC, didn't go well. Kirk, we're going to see the same script here with LSU. If anything, some people will say, as the phrase goes, on the hoof, nobody looks better than LSU. More of the same for Notre Dame? Uh, I have my concerns in this game if you're, uh, if you're a Notre Dame <laughs> right, fan. I, I'm, with, I'm with Mark. Yeah, and, you know, if, if Brady Quinn's struggled all year with pass or not, he hasn't struggled, but his offensive line has struggled with pass protection. And Mark's right. Bo Pelini will drive a scheme. They'll try to put a lot of pressure on, on Brady Quinn. I think it's the other side of the ball that we've seen Notre Dame exploited all year when they played against teams that can run. And, and I believe when you look at the group of wide receivers that Jamarcus Russell has, top to bottom, you look at those top three, or four, maybe as good as there is, not only in the SEC, but in the country. And the secondary of Notre Dame, kind of the Achilles heel for that defense, I think will struggle mightily stopping the speed. If Jamarcus Russell is on his game, it's going to be another long night for the Irish defense. Lee, how do you see the matchup between the Irish and the Tigers? Absolutely. LSU is the best looking in the history of football, best looking physical team I've ever seen with two losses. I mean, when you see these guys on the hoof, as you said, you can't believe it. But you know what? They can play, and they're mean, and they're tough. <laughs> and remember one thing, interesting. The last time they went to a bowl in a dome, they clobbered Miami. This football team is waiting to explode, and I'm telling you, Notre Dame got the worst pick of anybody in the country to play in a bowl team. I would not want to play LSU if I was the Indianapolis Colts. These guys are really, really good on all, and physically, man, do they look good. It's a good looking football team. I'm telling you, Notre Dame's got the toughest assignment in all of the bowl games, in my opinion. Beat LSU in a home game for LSU. <laughs> <laughs> I don't disagree with you. There are some who say that it was only the schedule that did in LSU and no. kept them from playing for the national championship. They had a brutal in-conference road schedule in the SEC.